The state has started closing another park and ride in Milwaukee County. Last week, the whole Avenue park and ride was closed off, and now it's happening at the College Avenue locations. And that's exactly where we find our Bill Miston joining us with what's next for some who call it home. Bill? Hey there, Mary. Just to set the scene right now, fencing is up around the northeast slide, and as you can see, a state patrol vehicle not letting anyone in. Over at the southwest slot here at the College Avenue Park and Ride, people who live there tell me they're being given a little bit more time to try and pack up their things, and hopefully they hope to find a more permanent place to live. Really? <laughs> Rick and his dog Sasha have called the College <laughs> Avenue Park and Ride lot home off and on for months. We came through today with another letter saying we got till the third. So it buys us more time. Instead of spending money on a hotel, I can use money to get my vehicle fixed. Rick says he's a veteran and works overnights and could stay in a hotel, but wouldn't have much money left to try and find his own place if he could find one. I could drop $25 for an application fee and get rejected. You know, do that multiple times waste of money. Earlier this month, the state began shutting down the park and rides, citing a 42% increase in police calls compared to 2023. Even as the county helped people find stable housing, more people kept showing up. Unfortunately, what we have not seen is additional resources being added. The homeless outreach group Street Angels says it comes down to housing. As far as solutions, obviously more shelter space and more affordable housing. Right. Until those solutions are available, Street Angels will be out in the community making sure that people just have what they need to survive outside. The county says its outreach teams will continue to try and get people housed as the Parks Department had to shut down a road at Wilson Park and clear out campers and vehicles over the weekend. For Rick, I'm wondering what the powers that be that decided to throw us out of here. The shelters are full. Where do they expect people to go? Did they think that through? He says he can only control one thing at a time. Now the southwest slot of College Avenue will remain partially open to serve transit riders, but here the northeast slot, it will remain closed. We're told that police are only letting people in to gather their belongings, and then they have to leave. Reporting live in Milwaukee, Bill Miston, Fox 6 News. Bill, thank you for that update.